of ferocity unseen in recent years. Cyclone Mokha slammed into parts of Bangladesh and Myanmar. It's just the beginning of the season and it's been devastating. Satellite pictures show its fierce eye over the region. In its path live more than three million people. The vulnerable evacuated to shelters. Homes, land, vegetation, infrastructure, nothing spared as it made its way inland. Rooftops ripped off and trees uprooted by its savagery. Winds touching 130 miles an hour brought three meter storm surges that inundated low lying towns and cities. Its effects have been felt on the world's largest refugee camp, where a million Rohingyas fled persecution by the Myanmar military. Their flimsy homes made from mud, bamboo and tarpaulin offer little protection, but miraculously they have been largely spared. It's across the border in Myanmar that aid agencies are most concerned. With the ongoing conflict between ethnic minorities and the military, access to these vulnerable areas is hard to get. We estimate that about 6 million people in this affected area were already in humanitarian need even before this cyclone. Um, and the damage that has been caused is only going to make that worse. Misery heaped once again on those endured decades of conflict, poverty and uncertainty. Never Lazarus, Sky News.